reflection of light at curved surfaces exam problems solutions analysis predictions problem 1.1 an object of height 5 cm is placed at 30 cm distance on the principal axis in front of a concave mirror of focal length 20 cm find image distance and size of image this question came in march 2016 in telangana state for four marks now what are the given things given things are now what he has given height of the object is equal to 5 centimeters and object distance is equal to 30 centimeters he has given and focal length is equal to 20 centimeters and they have also given in the problem that it is concave mirror now what are the expectations expectations or what is to be found now what is asking image distance v is equal to how much and size of the image i is equal to how much these two questions they are asking in the examinations in this question in this problem they are asking now what are the related formulas related formulas what are the related formulas one we know that it is 1 by f is equal to 1 by v plus 1 by u this is mirror formula and we know one more problem that is magnification magnification m is equal to h i by h o height of the image by height of the object it is also given by minus of image distance by object distance so these are now these are cons these are concepts these are formulas and the relation between these two is known as connections now what are the connections connections are relations between the concepts and the formulas now what are these connections connections are relations or relations now what is here what we have to relate here we have to relate about sign convention sign convention now sign convention means we have to use plus or minus sign in front of or for the um, concepts or for the terms we use in this question now since it is a concave mirror and we measure the distances from the pole and the distances we measure here are opposite to the direction of the movement of the incident ray so we take u is equal to minus u that is equal to minus 30 centimeters and f is equal to minus f is equal to minus 20 centimeters and we also expect v to be also minus v and we will find out this now here apply the formula let us apply the formula now solution part is 1 by f is equal to 1 by v plus 1 by u we know that then from this we can also say that this is equal to 1 by f we can say or 1 by v is equal to 1 by f minus 1 by u now we can expect that this is equal to 1 by minus 20 minus of 1 by minus u minus u is equal to here how much it is minus 30 so this becomes so 1 by 30 minus 1 by 20 which becomes is equal to here we get minus 2 minus 
थ्री बाय सिक्सटी वील गेट माइनस वन बै सिक्सटी सो वी गेट वी इज ईक्वल टू माइनस सिक्सटी सो दिस मीन दट द इमेज डिस्टेंस ईज माइनस सिक्सटी आर एस यू कैन आलो से दिस इज ईक्वल टू डिस्टेंस कैन नाट बी मै नेगेटिव सो वी हेव टू टेक वी इज ईक्वल टू सिक्सटी सेंटीमीटर्स नाउ वी हेव टू फाइंड नाउ सो फार वी आर एबल टू फाइंड दिस इज इमेज डिस्टेंस वी आर एबल टू फाइंड इमेज डिस्टेंस वी आर एबल टू फाइंड नाउ द नेक्स्ट पार्ट इज सैज ऑफ द इमेज सैज ऑफ द इमेज इज ईक्वल टू हाउ मच सैज ऑफ द इमेज वील फाइंड औट सैज ऑफ द इमेज लाइक दिस कॉन्क्यू सैन कन्वेन्शन नो सैज ऑफ द इमेज इज ईक्वल टू माइनस ई बै हेच ओ इज ईक्वल टू माइनस ऑफ वि बै यू सो हेच ई इज ईक्वल टू माइनस वि बै u into h o so this is equal to minus of minus sixty by minus thirty into five centimeters so we get so this we get it as minus two into five centimeters we get minus ten centimeters so height of the image is equal to minus ten centimeters height cannot be negative so but here height indicates that height indicates that it is inverted so h i is equal to 10 cm so we are able to find so far things now coming to the analysis what is analysis here what type of analysis we are able we are we want to see here analysis so analysis so here we have to analyze that now the image is, we, we know that object distance we know object distance we know image distance we know object height we know image height we know and we also know object distance image distance focal length we know and we also know that it is concave mirror and from this we can also draw Uh, draw the ray diagram and we can also find ray diagrams where is the position of the position of the image you can also know now we can also expect the nature of the image nature of image so all these things we we can analyze from this question now what are the predictions so what are what are predictions predictions means so we are uh, we expect certain questions from the same information the predictions means expected expected questions expected questions for future exams from this question based on based on the same concept same concept now see here here from this question we can also find that we can we can expect certain questions question number 1 what we can expect <laughs> what is the uh, nature of the nature of image so what is the nature of the image they can ask in the examination now so one more question what we expect is draw ray diagram ray ray diagram for this information and we can also find it what is find radius of curvature what is radius of curvature and we can also they can also ask one more question that is what is the, what is the magnification m is equal to how much they can ask how many times the image has increased or enlarged with respect to the original size of the object so these questions are expected 
in the coming examination from the same concept. Now let us find what is the nature of the image. Nature of the image depends upon here the ray diagram we have to or else you can also find out the ray diagram first. Now let us find the ray diagram. Ray diagram. Now ray diagram I am drawing. This is concave mirror and this is principal axis. This is pole and this is focus. Focus is 10 centimeters he says. So PC focus PF is equal to focal length is equal to how much he has given focal length is equal to 20 centimeters he has given. So so PC is equal to radius of curvature is equal to 2F is equal to 2 into 20 is equal to 40 centimeters. So here we can express this is C center of curvature. This is F. Now here the object is at U is equal to 30 centimeters. So U is equal to 30 centimeters means the object is between between the see here the object is at 10 30 centimeters that is in between the 20 in between 30 and the 40 so here now let us draw the diagram now when you draw this now the object so this is incident light and the, when the incident ray goes like this you now it passes through the focus and one more thing we have to find it now this is this is the diagram so we can find out now like this we we'll draw this now this like now we get a, this is image we are able to find the image the image is inverted the image is inverted this is equal to I, I I dash O O dash is object this is object and this is image now we can also find nature what is the nature nature means nature nature means S O A P soap we can say S is size size means here what is happening the size is increased or enlarged 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 image we get it enlarged image the nature of image we are telling the nature of the image means size is enlarged this is orientation orientation means how the object it is inverted inverted so the object is inverted like this and a means appearance appearance it is real image it is real image because it is formed in front of the concave mirror so it is real image now what is pp is means position of the image where is the position it is at a distance of v is equal to 60 centimeters 60 centimeters so this is all about nature of the image in the examination they may ask about ray nature of the image this is answer 2 and this answer 1 uh, ray diagram they can also ask ray diagram this is answer 1 question will answer this this is about this ray diagram now what is r third question is answer to third question is r is equal to 2f is equal to 2 into 20 is equal to 40 centimeters this is also one more question now one more question is what is e fourth question a magnification magnification is equal to h i by h 0 is equal to minus uh, 60 
what is h0 h0 is equal to how much we got it h is equal to how much we got it hi is equal to 10 centimeters 10 centimeters by 5 hours 5 centimeters so this is equal to 2 so magnification is equal to 2 magnification is 2 that means image size of the image size of image is twice of twice of object object size so this so these are the expected questions from the same th thing is first nature of the image they can ask nature of the image they can ask in the examination or draw the ray diagram they can ask or what is the radius of curvature they can ask or else they can also ask what is magnification so these are the things six of the image this question came in march 2015 for four marks in the ss examinations held in telangana state now what are the given things here now what are given in this height of the object he has given six centimeters and he has given object distance u is equal to 30 centimeters and he has given focal length is equal to 10 centimeters he has given and he says it is a concave mirror so these are the things given now what are the expectations what they are expecting from this now what at what distance from the mirror will the image be formed that means v is equal to how much and he they are also asking image characteristics image characteristics he is asking image characteristics means size of the image orientation of the image appearance of the image and position of the image they are asking how it will be so we will answer this now what are the useful formulas used here now we have 1 by f is equal to 1 by v plus 1 by u we have and we have one more formula that is magnification is equal to h i by h o object and magnification we have one more formula minus v by u so these formulas we will use now so the given things and expectations and formulas now we have connections what are the connections connections are the relations between the concepts and the formulas now here sign convention is a convention sign convention is a connection so by using sign convention here now u becomes minus u and v becomes minus v so when the answer will be minus in, in in terms of minus you will get and f is equal to minus 10 centimeters in sign because it is a concave mirror and all the distance are measured from the pole and we measure the distances from the pole and the measurement is done in in opposite direction to the direction of movement of the in in incident ray so we take minus sign for these things u now u becomes minus u means minus 30 centimeters and here v is equal to we have to find out now sign convention now let us do solution what is the solution how you have to do the solution now see here we use the formula so 1 by f is equal to 1 by v minus 1 by v plus 1 by u so 1 by v here becomes 1 by f minus 1 by u so here we will get 1 by minus 10 minus of 1 by minus 30 so when you solve this we will get 1 by 30 minus 1 by 10 so we will get 1 minus 3 by 30 
so we get this will minus 2 by 30 so we'll get minus 1 by 15 so which implies that v is equal to minus 15 centimeters so the first answer is we are able to achieve the first answer that is at what distance from the mirror the image is formed the image is formed at a distance of 15 centimeters from the pole or the, from the pole of the mirror so here the image is formed at a distance of 15 centimeters from the mirror so the first part of the question is answered here now what are the characteristics of the image we have to find the characteristics of the image so for finding the characteristics we have to know here so some basics that is here see here now when we know v we can also say that we know v so let us observe let us find out h 0 h i by h i by h is equal to magnification so here it is also equal to minus v by u so minus of minus 15 by minus 30 is equal to so here 1 by 2 we will get so here magnification is equal to 0 0.5 that means we get here so magnification is 0 0.5 means it is diminished image we will get it. diminished so this is about like this so diminished image we are able to get so minus v by v so diminished image we are able to get now we can also find out what is the size of the image also we can also find out h i by h g h o is equal to minus v by u so h i is equal to minus v by u into h o so minus of minus 15 by minus 30 into h o is equal to how much 6 centimeters so here how you get it so minus and minus will get cancelled so so 15 into 6 by 30 is equal to 15 ones are 15 twos are so 6 by 2 is equal to minus 3 centimeters so height cannot be in negative centimeters so it indicates here that that it is the inverted image the image is image is inverted the image is inverted and image is image is inverted and image is diminished so diminished diminished image you get so these are the characteristics of the image now the image is formed at a distance of so 15 centimeters so 15 image is is formed between the focus and is formed is formed The image is inverted and image is formed between focus and focus and the center of the curvature so the, the image is inverted diminished image is formed at center of the curvature now 
size is size is reduced reduced or it is diminished so size so nature or characteristics means here what we will say so s size is reduced or diminished and orientation is orientation is here inverted 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 orientation and appearance appearance is is equal to here real image where the image is real so this is about a real image and position is so it is formed the image is formed is formed between focus and center of curvature so we are able to so far we are able to answer this now here we have to find out the analysis analysis part analysis part we will find out analysis we will find out so here the image is diminished diminished image we got it so hi is is less and ho is more so the object size is diminished and we know the u value we know the v value and we know the f value and we know the magnification how much it is reduced so based on these things so this is about analysis of the uh, problem given problem so we know all these things and we also know about uh, the sign convention now coming to let us solve about what are the predictions what are predictions predictions means expected questions from the same question so in future what we can expect from this question or based on their concepts uh, involved in this question what are the different types of questions we may get in the future examinations so here we can uh, we can expect one thing is one question may come that is draw ray diagram draw ray diagram for this data and they may ask also what is the radius of curvature so they may ask and they may ask also what is the magnification so these they can ask now so here we can answer this r is equal to so 2f so is equal to 2 into f is equal to how much we have so f is equal to 10 centimeters so we have r is equal to minus 10 so r is equal to 2 into 10 is equal to 20 centimeters so r we can get r minus n we will get because of the sign convention or r is equal to 20 centimeters we can take it now what is magnification is equal to magnification is given here as see here h or h i by h o or else it is equal to minus v by u or else here it is minus of minus 15 by 30 degrees minus so this is equal to so minus 1 by 2 is equal to minus 0 0.5 so this is the no units for this so magnification has no units minus 0 0.5 means so the size is diminished diminished or decreased we can say so in this way we can also find m is equal to we can say 0 0.5 diminished so this is about that now let us draw the ray diagram so what is how can we draw the ray diagram 
in the future uh, this is the uh, predicted prediction question this is the predicted question now we'll draw the ray diagram so he says it is a concave mirror so we have concave mirror like this so this is back side of the mirror so it is silver coating on this so this is equal to pole we have from the pole and the f it is 10 centimeter so here f is equal to pf is equal to we have 10 centimeters and c this is c so twice so r is equal to pc is equal to twice of f is equal to we get 20 centimeters we get 20 centimeters and the object is kept at 30 centimeters 30 centimeters means beyond the center of curvature 30 centimeters so the object is kept at beyond the beyond the center of curvature so let us do like this so this is object when the object is kept is now the rays travel from the object the rays travel from the object and move like this but we move we take the uh, di direct measurements from p to c now when the di when the ray is traveling from the object and it falls on the concave mirror and it will try to move like this so this is the direction of the this incident ray and this is reflected ray now we have another ray moves from here and it was travels like this so it passes through the center of curvature and now we get here the image will get here the image will be like this and the image is image will get like this so i i dash will get so i i dash is equal to image and o o dash is equal to object so image size here we got here image is we how much we got image is equal to image is equal to 3 centimeters we got and object is equal to here we got 6 centimeter so here the image is reduced so this is about ray diagram so these are all predictions so problem 1.3 draw the ray diagram to show the formation of image for the object of height 1 cm placed at 5 cm distance in front of a convex mirror having radius of curvature r is equal to 5 cm given information given data so here what he has given is so height of the object is equal to 1 cm he is given object distance is equal to u 5 centimeters given radius of curvature is equal to 5 centimeters given and uh, convex mirror he says convex mirror convex mirror he has mentioned and when r is given indirectly f is also given f is equal to r by 2 is equal to 5 by 2 centimeters so this is about the given data now what is expected here what is expected expected thing expectations or what is required in the answer now here it is he is asking about a ray diagram so so ray diagram related to formation of formation of image so when the how does the image form and based on the 
image formation how it is how the ray diagram looks this is what expected in the question now what are the related formulas used here no formulas formulas so we use here r is equal to 2f or f is equal to r by 2 so this formula is used here while drawing the ray diagram to locate the focal length of the uh, focal length in the ray diagram now what are the connections what are the connections connections are relations between the concepts and the formulas here when we know that it is a convex mirror convex mirror we have to convex mirror so when it is mentioned as convex mirror we have to use the sign convention correctly so in this case what happens so u becomes so u u becomes negative u becomes negative and v f and r r r r positive so this we will apply while drawing the ray diagram now coming to the question no sign convention u is equal to v is equal to we have now we'll apply the ray diagram ray diagram now we know that it is a let us draw the ray diagram now this is a convex mirror so inner part is silver painted so outer parts is shiny part it reflects the part now we have this is pole and the object is kept at a, in front of the convex convex mirror at a distance of 5 cm o o dash is object and this is here o o dash is equal to height of the object is equal to 1 cm he has given so now we have to draw the ray diagram see here how the ray starts from object and falls on the convex mirror and it rebounds back and this is known as reflected ray now when it is falling on this now it appears as if it is taken back side so when you take it back side it is this is focal length f now we have another ray travels here from this place and we we'll take this ray like this and so suppose it moves like this the ray travels like this and meets at the center of curvature now at the cross section at the at the cross section of the reflected ray and the incident ray we have the image is formed now the image looks like this the image is formed here so this is image i i dash so the image is formed between the mirror and the focus between the mirror and the focus you can say now it is in between the pole of the mirror and the focus and the image is formed behind the mirror so this is virtual image and it is erect image and the size is diminished so the ray diagram is drawn like this so the answer to the solution is over complete now we have analysis this is extra part 
एनालिसिस एनालिसिस पार्ट नो व्हाट इज एनालिसिस हियर सो दिस इज ए कॉन्केव दिस इज अ कॉन्वेक्स मिरर कॉन्वेक्स मिरर एंड इन कॉन्वेक्स मिरर वी हैव ओनली टू डायग्राम्स इन कॉन्वेक्स मिरर वी हैव ओनली टू रे डायग्राम्स ओनली टू रे डायग्राम्स वी हैव दिस वी हैव टू रिमेंबर एंड व्हेन द ऑब्जेक्ट इज वेरी वेरी फार फ्रॉम द एट एट इनफिनिटी then we get virtual image erect image and highly diminished and point size image when the object is at infinity and the next case is as mentioned here here we have here we have the here u is equal to minus and v r f r positive we have to take and one more ray diagram when the object is kept between the infinity and the pole of the mirror so in this case this is applicable in in such case the ob the image is formed between the pole and the focus we have seen here we have seen here between the focus and the pole we have found and it is diminished virtual and direct so this is all about analysis now what are the predictions predictions are expected questions for the future examinations from the concepts related to this question now what type of questions can come here let us observe question number 1 we can expect next time from the same concept nature of the image so they may ask about nature of image then question 2 find value of focal length f question number 3 find value of image distance question 4 find value of height of the image or image size they can ask and one more question is they may ask about find magnification value m value so these five types of questions may be predicted in the coming examination from the concepts related to this question so we'll move further and we'll try to answer these predicted questions also we'll try to answer now nature of the image answer 1 nature of the image so nature means here we have s o a p so so s means size size of the object is diminished or highly diminished diminished and we have orientation orientation of the image is here it is erect image we have erect image we have and appearance appearance how does the image appear it is virtual so virtual image is formed because it is formed behind the behind the mirror we have now one more thing what is the position of the image position of the image the image is formed between the image is formed between pole and focus and it is formed behind the behind the mirror so this is all about the nature now let us answer question number 2 that is f is equal to how much so 
R is equal to 2F we know. So F is equal to R by 2. So we have so 5 by 2 is centimeters. R is it is equal to 2.5 centimeters. So this is about another question. Now coming to the answer 3. Answer 3. What is V is equal to how much? So V is equal to how much means here we will find out the formula we have so what is the formula we have so we have one formula known as 1 by f is equal to 1 by v plus plus 1 by u we have so then we will get 1 by v plus 1 by u is equal to 1 by f or 1 by v is equal to 1 by f minus 1 by u we have now this is 1 by f means here so 1 by f means 1 by f is equal to how much we have taken 5 by 2 and minus of 1 by u means here minus 5 so minus 5 so this is equal to 2 by 5 minus plus 1 by 5 so this becomes 3 by 5 so 1 by v is equal so v is equal to 5 by 3 so which approximately comes as 1.66 centimeters so this is the value so this is equal to v the image distance now coming to the let us answer question number 4 what is question number 4 here what is this find the value of hi hi is equal to we know one form hi so we have hi is equal to hi by ho is equal to minus v by u we know so hi is equal to minus v by u into ho so minus v means here 5 by 3 by u means here minus of 5 and into ho is equal to 1 centimeter so we have minus 5 by 3 into 1 by minus 5 into 1 so this and this will go so 1 by 3 we got it this is approximately equal to 0 0.33 centimeters so height of the image we are able to find now finally we will find out answer to the fifth question fifth question what is the fifth question here we have find the value of m m is equal to how much so m is equal to how much we have m is equal to h i by h zero so h i by h zero is equal to h i is equal to what we have h i is equal to 1 by 3 we have and ho is equal to height of object is equal to 1 we have so 1 by 3 into 1 by 1 is equal to 1 by 3 so this is approximately 0 0.33 here the, the, this is not having any units because m is magnification it's merely a number a number of times magnified or diminished so here 0 0.33 means there is no negative sign here that means 0 0.33 means the image is diminished now we can also find m value using another formula minus v by u minus of minus v means v is equal to 5 by 3 by u is equal to u is equal to minus 5 so minus 5 by 3 into 1 by minus 5 so this and this goes is equal to 1 by 3 is equal to 0 0.33 so here also we are able to find the magnification so in this way we are able to answer the five predicted questions from the same concept also so nature of the image nature of the image value of the f value of v value of hi and value of m so these are all additional information uh, useful for the coming examinations so this is about solution of this question.